What's going on everyone? It's Adam here from Adam's Nintendo World and we are going to be playing Big Brain Academy Brain vs. Brain on Nintendo Switch and we're already being greeted. Good day! I am told I always seem knowledgeable about whatever I'm speaking on. It's quite flattering. But honestly, the more I've learned, the more I've known, I've become aware of how much I don't know. I suppose that's the course of life. Spent learning. It's worth it though. Well, now that you know that, shall we begin? And we shall begin by clicking start. Thank you so much for joining me for this episode, guys. We are going to do a premiere of this game. Look at some of the mini games inside. Let's see how stupid and or smart I am. I like to think I'm smart, but who knows? Uh, this suit has become a bit snug. I'm going to guess he's going to talk to us a little bit while we sit here on the home screen. But uh, thank you for joining me. Uh, we'll shout out our awesome Patreon, YouTube, and special friends list a little bit later in the episode. But for right now, let's hop in and see what Big Brain Academy Brain vs. Brain is all about. Okay, so I'm going to hit start here, and we're going to get going. We are going to play uh, solo. We're going to play it by ourselves. Uh, student enrollment for Adam. So as you can see, all of your users will actually show up, which is interesting. This doesn't have, this doesn't really happen in games very often, so I can hit student enrollment for Adam, and then we can hop in. Hi, hello there. How do you do? Welcome to Big Brain Academy. I am the headmaster of this academy. You can call me Dr. Loeb. Do you feel as if your brain has been a bit more stiff than usual? Well, here at the Academy, we offer a variety of activities to help you stretch and flex that brain of yours. So without further ado, let's get, stre start let's get started stretching your brain. To begin, we'll enroll you in, a in the Academy, so if you would, tell us about yourself. First, please tell us your age. Alright, so, uh, you guys can know me. I don't care. Some people are very secretive about this stuff, just not me. I was born in 19... 88. So there we go. Next, please tell us your style. Don't worry, you can always change this later. Uh, Alright, we are going to be a boy. Now let's move on to your occupation. Choose something close to your real occupation if you would. Okay, um, I guess I would be considered a civil servant, I believe. Although, office worker, like I don't know what the difference is. Um, I'm going to go with civil servant. Next up, your catchphrase. You can change this later, so just pick anything that strikes your fancy now. Uh, praise is precious. Tired, oh so very tired. Buried in homework, send help. <laughs> I just can't. That one made me laugh. That was the first one that made me laugh, so I had to do it. All right, finally, please select the appearance you prefer while attending our academy. You can change this later as well, so don't fret too much about it. I won't. I won't fret about it. Um... Let's see here. We'll go down. I don't want to spend too much time in here, although I want to give you guys an idea of what all the options are. Um, so there we go. Not a ton, but enough, like more than I would have thought. So uh, let's just go like this. Um, I like to I like to have a beard, so there we go. Uh, a shirt. Uh, I like blue. We're going to go with blue. I love how there's no pants in this situation, just a shirt. Look at all these unlockables, guys. Uh, looks like this is all stuff you can unlock, which is a lot of fun. And then uh, let's grab, I have glasses, something kind of like this actually. All right, let's hit all done and kind of move on from here. Okay, so um, I think we're finished. Look at all these unlockables though. Like this is crazy, look at it all. That's awesome. All right, all done. Also, allow me to introduce our online features. You can compete with others in Ghost Clash or rankings. Um, yeah, we'll, s oh shoot, no, I meant to say use, oh well. With that, a warm welcome to you, Adam. Your enrollment is now complete. That means it's time to begin your journey at Big Brain Academy. Okay, now then, first off, let's begin by stretching and flexing your brain in practice. Okay, so we have practice, ghost clash, tests, but I don't think we can do this yet, so let's go to practice. Ta-da! Welcome to practice. It's our specialty here at the Academy. If I may, I suggest you start by trying an activity in the identify category. Okay, so let's hit identify. Uh, why not give Whack-A-Match a try? Okay, Whack-A-Match. You can play with either button or touch controls. I feel like some of these things might be easier with touch controls, if I'm being honest. But, maybe I'm wrong. I could be wrong, but I feel like maybe touch controls might make this game a little easier. Alright, uh, whack the mole with the matching picture. Start. Uh, whack the mole with these. Uh, I don't know what the controls are, though. That's the... Okay, here we go. Bam. Uh, bam. 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 All right, so you got to do this faster. I'm doing it way too slow. This one. <laughs> that one. All right. Uh, oh, no. No. <laughs> that one. I need a spoon. That one. 
Alright, uh... No! That one. That one. This one. <laughs> ah! No! Oh my goodness, I'm not doing well. Oh! Once I get that first one, the other ones are no problem. Dang it. Oh, no. No! <laughs> I guess I'm not too smart. I don't know how this tests your smart. I mean, I guess it tests your ability to quickly make decisions. But again, think about doing that one tapping as opposed to having to move, right? Like, there is that slight delay. If I could tap it 100%, I would be able to do that way better. The results are in. Big Brain Bronze, 707. That was your first time doing this practice activity. What do you think? My media obligan... My medulla oblig... I'm not very smart, guys. I fail. Let's quit the game now. Uh, your Big Brain Brown... Your Big Brain Bronze score has conquered the 600 mark. How wonderful. Now then, to commemorate this moment, allow me to present you with two gold lobe medals. Okay, in the top corner, it looks like we we're trying to try to collect 10. I have high expectations of you going forward. All right, so two... You practiced, your brain top 600, and you flexed your brain for 9. So we're going to get a gift. And the gift is... Kingly Robes. Nice. That's better than just a standard shirt. And it goes into the unlock stuff. Uh, do you want to change right now? Yeah. I want to wear the Kingly Robe. Right there. Okay. We're at 1 of 10 for another prize. Alright. Allow me to share a bit of big brain trivia. Try to collect all the gold lobe, metal, gold lobe medals. It's bound to be worth the effort. The path will not be easy. Still, I hope you'll take up the challenge. And that's some big brain, big, 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 oh my goodness. <laughs> that's some big brain trivia for you. All right, done, I guess. So what did you think of your first big brain academy experience? Your journey towards impressive big brain bronze scores, big brain bronze scores has just begun. Feel free to flex your brain to your heart's content. A brawny brain is worth achieving. All right, let's practice more. Uh, let's try memorize. And we're going to do uh, flash memory. I am not good at flash memory. Uh, memorize the numbers and symbols and repeat them before you forget. Uh, buttons only, because I, I don't have the switch in touch screen mode, which I wish I did. Okay, use the buttons. What were the numbers and symbols? Here we go. Let's see what we can do. Two digits. Seven, seven. That's easy. Three digits. Uh, one, one, six. Oh, no! See? That was just a screw up. Can I use a D-pad instead? Uh, six, boom, six. Uh, six, two, four. Four digits. Six, two, two. Uh, six, two, two, two. See, it's just so much faster to tap, right? Uh, I missed that. I was not paying attention. Uh... Oh, no. I know what this is, though. Oh! 8331. 8331. Five digits. Ooh. 11 one heart 86. 11 one heart 86. Five digits. 31261. 31261. Ah. It, it's like this game is meant for handheld. There's no way you can accurately decide how good or bad you are at something within this game using button controls. I just don't think it's it's realistic. I could do that way faster tapping. I mean, I'm glad there are button controls. But I, I'm, I'm... I'm 10 minutes in right now and I don't think button controls are the way to go. If you really want to be accurate with how good you are at things. Results are in. Your big brain score is 377. That was your first time doing this practice activity. What do you think? You've pushed your big brain bronze score right across the 250 line. Now, to commemorate this moment, I'll give you three silver lobes medals. What's the difference between silver and gold? I have high expectations of you going forward. So we got one gold, but what are the silver for? I guess they don't qualify? Like, you need to... Alright, let's try next. Uh, no, let's go back. I want to try something from, like, each... Oops, let's go into practice. Oh, that is next. So we're going to do analyze. So we'll just keep going through. So we'll analyze, compute, and then visualize. So let's uh, analyze first. Uh, we'll do the cube game. Count the number of cubes. Try to find the best counting method. All right, let's see if we can do this. 
How many cubes are there? Um, three, uh, four, um, five, uh, ten, <laughs> um, six, uh, nine, uh, thirteen, ah, oh, okay, uh, four, seven, uh, eleven, uh, oh, three, six, nine, twelve, sixteen, Oh, geez. Uh, 3, 6, 9, 11, 17, 18. Uh, 6, 11, 15, 18, 21. Uh, 3, 6, 9, 12. Uh, 15, 18, 19. Uh, 3, 6, 9, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26. There we go. I felt pretty good about that one, actually. That one I felt a little bit better about. The results are in. Uh, big brain score of 682. That was your first time doing this practice video. What'd you think? Uh, I beat the mark of 600. So uh, how wonderful. Now then commemorate this moment. Allow me to give you two gold lobe medals. Awesome. I have high expectations of you going forward. So there we go. Two more. And I like, I think you get nine every day just for practicing. I don't know if that's just a one-time thing or if that's something you'll continue to get. I'm interested to know um, if that's going to be the case. All right, let's hit next. Start when you're ready. Com this is compute. Uh, pop the balloons in order from lowest to highest. See, again, this is one that's going to be way better with a controller. Why can't I tap? Oh, there. That, it didn't even register. That was weird. Five, seven, eight. That first time didn't register. No! Dang it! Uh, two, three, four, seven. Uh, three, ten, eleven, twelve. I get this one here. It's trying to screw you up, I think, with, like, different size balloons to try to mess you up, but, I mean, it's not going to mess me up. The only time I messed up was an accident. Ah, no, it was accidents. That's the only time I mess up. 4, 12, 13, 14, 15, uh, 4, no, no, that was a mistake, <laughs> I'll, I'll own the mistake on that one, but, 13, okay, 1, 2, 7, no, I thought that was 41, <laughs> I screwed up two of those, I'll admit to screwing up two of those, that was not good. Uh, I feel like this is terrible. 276. Oh, 250 line. But I want to cross the... I'm going to get silver for this. Yeah, silver is not good. I want to cross 600. All right. Uh, we'll take it and we'll just kind of move on. Uh, so this is visualize. Pick the pieces that complete the puzzle. Ooh. Uh, buttons only. So my only option. Use the buttons. Which pieces complete the puzzle? Uh, this one and that one. Uh, this and that and that. Uh, this, this, and that. Oh, and that. Two more. Okay. Um, see, this one I know for a fact I would not be good at. Um, I'm not good with shapes. I'm really not. Uh, we're gonna take that. We're gonna take this. We're gonna take, uh, no. Oh, yeah, okay. No! Dang it! Um, let's take this. This, uh, this. <laughs> no! Oh my goodness. See, this is this is just me sucking. I'll admit that right now. I can admit that right now. Uh, and then that one. This is me just not being good. Oh, geez, Louise. This one's interesting. Um, oh, gee. <laughs> oh, no, I want the triangle. Oh, man. Okay, that's hard. That one is hard. I'll admit that's hard. Even if I was touching, using touch controls, that would be the visualized one for me, obviously, is very difficult. Let me know if you would be better at that than something else. That actually interests me what you guys would think. 150. <laughs> Two silver. <laughs> oh, that's no good. You practice. You get one. All right. I just want to go back for a second and just kind of see what my options are here. Is it just going back through? Okay. So we're going to continue to cycle through the games, which I'm okay with, but... We did a different compute. We didn't actually do them in order. So, all right, let's just keep going here, I think. Um, and we'll see what we can do. 
Species Spotlight. All right, this one looks interesting. Let's give this for a go. Um, identify, this is an identify puzzle. Which animal is there more of? Look around with the spotlight. All right, I'm not gonna be good at this either. This is gonna be a quick, uh, a quick draw to see how many, um, look around. Okay, got it, dog. Oh, I see, I can do this forever. Uh, got it, mouse. Um, got it, ant. Uh, got it, B. Uh, got it, ladybug. Um, oh, oh man, that was, uh, ant? Oh, that was a lucky guess. Uh, butterfly. That, it depends how many there are, right? It seems like there's not a ton, but now we're moving up in the intermediate class. So there we go. Um, I feel like intermediate class is like easier just because I see more of the same ones, so it's easy to pick them out. Uh, ant. I mean, I know there's more options, but like, ant. <laughs> I feel like it's easier to, s oh, that one I don't know. <laughs> I lied. That one I didn't know. Uh, that looks like ant. And really quickly, uh, grasshopper. And really quickly, ant. Oh, I snuck that last one in there. <laughs> one mistake, and I snuck that last one in there. I love it. Results are in. Over 600? Nope. About 400, though. Will that get me one gold? One gold, Lobe. All right. I think I could do actually way better on that one. But that's okay. We'll move on. Uh, let's go next. This is a memorize. Memorize the picture on the card before it flips. Which one was it? Okay. Memorize the cards and answer. Sure. All right, a moon. Memorized. Moon. Uh, memorized. Memorized. Uh, memorized. Ooh. Burger. Apple. Oh, shoot. Uh, dog and ant. No, I accidentally clicked too quick on that one. Uh, that is uh, grapes. Oh, grapes, watermelon, chocolate. Uh, grape, watermelon. There we go. Uh, lollipop, flower, chocolate. Uh, lollipop, uh, flower, 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 flower. <laughs> uh, okay. Oh, jeez. Um, dang it. <laughs> I'm not good at memorizing, and I know that. I know that for a fact. Results are in. Oh, that's terrible. Silver. I don't want silver. I want gold. All right. Analyze. Match blast. Uh, break blocks to create the same shape as the example on top. Interesting. Okay. Break blocks to copy the top shape. But again, this is a tapping one, right? This is one that um, we need. You need to tap. Uh, there we go. Ooh, uh, that one almost made the wrong decision there. Um, that. Okay, uh, we're gonna take away that one. What? There we go. No! Oh, I see. I gotta think these through. Um, I gotta think these through. This is not easy, guys. There we go. You gotta really think about this. Some of them are easier than others, and you wouldn't think they would be, but they are. Um, I think we're gonna take away this. And no, that's not right. Um... That was difficult. Wow. Listen, I never thought this game would be this difficult. Like, these puzzles are way harder than I ever would have thought. Like, way harder. This is not an easy game. The results are in. But I could see how doing this more and more and more, you could train your brain. I really do. Mind you, I don't know how many puzzles there are, so could you memorize them all? That seems like likely you couldn't, but... Let me know as we go through the stream, I know we're already like 20 minutes in, but as we go through the stream, let me know what you would think you'd be best at. A space helmet. All right, cool, we got the space helmet. Uh, no, I don't wanna put that on now. All right, let's move on. Oh, wait, oops. All right, let's compute and let's do add agency. Choose two cards that add 
to the number shown at the top. Oh, add, grab two cards that will add the number at the top. Okay. Which two add up to the number? Uh, four, uh, two, and two. Five. Uh, one and four. Uh, four, uh, one and three. Uh, five, four and one. Five, four and one. Whoa, uh, seven. Uh, <laughs> wow. Uh, <laughs> I am having a rough go, guys. Uh, seven, uh, four, and three. Oh, geez, three, uh, seven, eight, uh, five, and three. What? That was not eight? Uh, seven. Uh, five and two. Uh, six, three, and three. Um, four, eight, ten. Uh, four, and... No, that's not even close. Uh, five, six, seven, five, and two. Uh, this is f eight, nine, uh, so we're gonna go two and seven. And this is, uh, three, five, nine. Nah, <laughs> I'm gonna blame the button controls, because again, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say if these were touch controls, I wouldn't be having as big of an issue. <laughs> but I think I'm just trying to make myself feel better about being terrible at this game. <laughs> All right, let's keep going. Let's see what else there is. Oh, I, I have to keep just saying yes. I want to keep going. All right, let's get in shape. Uh, shadow shift. Find the picture that matches the shadow. Okay. Match the picture to the shadow. Spoon. Vase. Racket. Oh, there's two. Uh, this one and that one. Three. Oh, geez, I couldn't see that top one. Uh, the crane for sure, the truck for sure, and what is that last one, the spaceship? Uh, this plant, this plant, and that plant. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, there we go. Jeez Louise, robot, this and that. Uh, I see a vase, I see a spoon, and I see, I think that, a shirt. Oh, wait, what? Oh, there's four. What the heck is that last one? A shoe? I didn't even notice there was four. Uh, I'm going to go with this one. That one. Uh, this one. That. No, the Frankenstein. Dang it. Um, and this one. I mean, 409. <laughs> All right. That's okay. Results are in. What did we get? 409. We're having a hard time. We're going to get one gold, though, this time at least. Ah, we're gonna have to go through and try to like best our score, I think. Like, I honestly think that's what we gotta do at this point. Um, we've only got gold on four of the ones we've done so far, which is pretty terrible. All right, we're gonna go back up to identify. We're gonna move to frame filler. Which piece belongs in the box? Pay attention to the movement. Pay attention to the movement. I should have looked at that way better. Um. No, what? I don't understand. Oh, which piece of... Oh, okay, I get it now. Um, That one. Wow. Uh, This one. No, I meant the... Dang it. That one. This is not easy. That one. Uh, That one. That one. You can kind of tell with, like, the colors. Oh, now the colors get more difficult. Um, this one. Oh, is there something up there? It has to be that. <laughs> uh, this one here. Oh, jeez. Uh, that one. Top of the purple. I always try to focus on, like, one thing and then figure out... Oh, no. And just try to figure it out, right? Nope. I'm trying to get above... I lose points. I didn't realize you lose points when you get it wrong. Oh my. Okay, so um, what we've learned, guys, is that Adam's stupid. I think that's what we've learned here. Adam's stupid. Although sympathize with me, right guys? Like, come on. Someone will sympathize with me. Reverse retention. Remember the order and answer in reverse. <laughs> Two, once, and then you have to go to one, two. Oh, this is gonna mess with my head. Repeat and reverse. Okay. Three, one, so one, three. 
baby dog. Uh, so dog baby. Me do Ray. Uh, Ray do me. Two, three, three, one. One, three, three, two. One, three, three, two. Scissors, horn, hammer. Hammer, horn, scissors. Two, three, six, two, three, three, two, six. Oh, no. Three, two, six, two, three. No, three, two. One, one, five, six, five. Five, six, five, one, one. Five, six, five, one. No! What? I was wrong? Four, two, four, one. One, four, two, four. Four, six, two, four, six. Four, six, two, four, six. Six, four, two, six, four. <laughs> Rooster line. Oh, the number ones are tricky. The 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 babies and the like the images. Those are easier for me. But we cracked four hundred, so at least we're gonna get a gold. But I really overachieved with that six hundred on the first the first one we did. I really overachieved um, on this identify one. Because <laughs> we haven't gotten close to that. Although we did here, the brick one. We were pretty decent at that. Okay, let's do uh, heavyweight. Which one is heaviest? Don't let looks trick you. Okay, yes. So, don't let looks trick you. Which one's heaviest? Ooh, uh, this one. No! That one. Not easy. Um, dog. <laughs> Frog. Oh, jeez. Um, nope. <laughs> I can't, guys. I just can't. Uh, two. If a blue equals two purple and two reds equal blue. Blue? <laughs> Um, nope. <laughs> uh, that's gonna be heaviest. An ant. Okay, I can get that one. Uh, a turtle. Um, <laughs> I honestly think I'm just embarrassing myself at this point. I crossed 400. Mind you, people in the chat, don't laugh at me until you've done it, right? Let's be fair. All right, we got another goal. Let's move on. Okay, so the next one's gonna be a compute. Um, we're gonna do mallet math. Whack the blocks you don't need to leave behind the correct total. Whack the blocks you don't need. Okay. We need five, uh, so we don't need that. Uh, we need three. Uh, we don't need that. Uh, three. Don't need that. Uh, Eleven. Jeez. Uh, we just don't need that. <laughs> Eleven. We don't need that or that. Uh, Fifteen. Four, eight, twelve. What? Eleven. Two fours and a three. Uh, ten. Uh, five, four, and one. Uh, fourteen. Nine, three, and two. Uh, fourteen. Uh, three, six, nine. That's all. <laughs> uh, twenty-seven. Nine, eight, seventeen. And seven is twenty-four. Oh, gee. Six and seven is thirteen, and nine is twenty-two. And I don't know. Nine, eighteen, uh, twenty-six, eight, eight. <laughs> What's <was> terrible? <laughs> oh my! Yeah, the results are in. You're stupid. I mean, I cracked three hundred. So I'm waiting for the day when I barely crack a hundred, guys. Like, I know they have gold and silver. Do they have bronze? I've never got a bronze if that exists. All right, let's go to visualize. Uh, train turn. Uh, add the missing track to get the train to exit. See, I like these kind of games, like on mobile and stuff. Again, I like to tap, but let's see if we can figure this out. Uh, straight. That was easy. 
uh, turn. Okay, uh, no, 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 that was just an accident. Um, uh, turn. Okay, beginner class. Uh, we're gonna go left and then right. Uh, we're gonna go straight and straight. We're gonna go, uh, there we go. Uh, we're gonna go this way and straight. Once they flip them, that's when it gets a little tricky. We're gonna go this way and that way. Uh, that was easy. Advanced class. Okay, so we're gonna go uh, this way, this way. No, that way twice. Dang it. Uh, we're gonna go this way and straight. We are gonna go this way, straight, and that way. Uh, this way, that way, straight. Um, this way, that way, straight. Um, oh dang, the board was starting to rotate. Did you guys see that? That's crazy. We did okay, right? Oh, almost 600. All right, 400. We top 400. That's going to get us one gold low medal. We were almost at six, though. That would have felt good. Oh, well. Sometimes you can't uh, get what you want. But we got another prize, so let's see what we're getting this time. Ooh, red glasses. Uh, thanks for the red glasses, but I'll change later. I don't want them. Okay, uh, done. All right, let's continue on to a... Uh, so we're done once. We have one left of all of them. So let's do one more of all of them, and then we'll see what else the game has to offer. Fast focus. What is the picture of, and how fast can you figure it out? If you've ever played, seen it before, they have these kind of things where like the screen's all wavy, and I absolutely suck at it. Uh, grasshopper. <laughs> like, I suck at these kind of things. What the heck is that? I'm gonna go polar bear is my initial thought. No, it's penguin. Uh, I'm gonna go with butterfly. Um, go. Uh, what's this? A fish, pony, dog, or eagle? Eagle. I see feathers. Alright, advanced class. I have no idea. I'm gonna go with dog off the top. Uh, yeah, that's a dog. I should've just clicked it. I felt it, right? Alright, um... Ostrich, rabbit, snail, or dog? That's a dog. Uh, pigeon, dolphin, cow, or sheep? Okay, give me something. I don't want to get this wrong, though, because I lose points. Dolphin! <laughs> we cracked... I already said, I said this, I was not good at this, and we cracked 600, so that's amazing. Results are in. 729. That is our highest yet. Um, we crack six, so we're going to get two gold. I wonder if you have to crack, like, eight to get three gold. Who knows? So, identify is actually a strong category for me. Gold, gold, silver, gold. That's pretty strong. Those are pretty good numbers. All right, let's go to memorize. Covered cages. Uh, where are the birds? Make the cages go faster if you're up for it. Oh, okay, so I can speed up time in order to get more stuff done and get a higher score. Okay. In the mess. Middle. Two birds. I'm not up for it. Three birds. So I'm going to follow the one that's not. That was easy. Two birds are not. So I'm going to follow the knots. All right, three birds. They're in a row. Oh, easy peasy. That was so easy. All right, three birds. They're all at the top. Uh, I think I know. There we go. Three birds, let's try this. This one's easy too. All right, three birds. Alright, that was not bad. I'll take that score. I'm pretty happy with that. We got, we got 700 something? 798. We're two points off 800. It would have been interesting to see if we crossed 800 what we would have got. But that's okay. I'll take it. Alright, so we've done... We're okay at this. Two gold and two silver. Uh, so we're going to move on to analyze. And we're going to go to speed sorting. 
Which picture fits the description? There could be more than one answer. Okay. <clears throat> See how smart I am with my animals and stuff like that. Has a tail. Turtle. A living thing. Uh, fastest. Insect. Uh, moves with four legs. Celestial body. <laughs> Second largest. Uh, head of lettuce. Cold-blooded frog. And this? Okay. Lays eggs. Fly. Has legs. Oh! Uh, okay. <laughs> Doesn't swim with fins. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> Moves with ten limbs. Octopus? Uh, celestial body. Uh, insect. Oh, no! Shoot! A spider's not an insect! Fourth largest. Ladybug. Has legs. Vehicle. Really? Has wings. Ladybug has wings? Has suckers. Doesn't have scales. Ugh. Alright, I don't know what my score was. I wasn't paying attention to score. How did I do? Ooh, just shy of 600. That's too bad. One gold, though. Would have liked to see two. Would have liked to see two, but that's okay. All right, we're okay there, too. Where are we the weakest? Compute is where we are the weakest. And this makes sense. I am not good at math. So, in some sense, this game is somewhat accurate. Tick-tock turn. Spring forward one hour. Oh, no. I'm screwed. Rotate the clock hands to match time. I'm screwed. I'm so screwed. Uh, set the time to three? Uh, no, that's... Uh, set the time to eight. Uh, fall back one hour. No! This thing is finicky. Set time to one. No! This is so finicky. I'm not taking the blame on this one. This one's just hard to do. It's just hard to control. Spring forward one hour. Spring forward one hour just difficult guys it's just difficult spring forward two hours i can do that i mean the concept's not hard like spring forward two hours spring forward three hours so we want to take this to five it's difficult the trying to spin it around is just too difficult i don't i don't say that's my fault <laughs> All right, so uh, that was a terrible score. Remember when I said, I wonder what happens when you get down around 100? Well, here we go. I'm down around 100. To commemorate, one silver. Oh, they don't give you bronze, I don't think. They're like, nah, we're not giving you bronze. You don't deserve bronze. It's silver or better. <laughs> that is terrible. All right, we got one more to do. So let's do visualize. It's called True View. How would it look if you looked at it from the direction of the arrow? How would it look if you looked at it from the direction of the arrow? This is interesting. Let's take a look. Um, it would look like this. No, it would not look like that. It would look like... No, it would not. <laughs> I'm over three. I'm over three. <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, I feel like this has just gone off the rails. Um, like, this isn't hard. <laughs> or it shouldn't be hard. <laughs> it shouldn't be hard. <laughs> As you can tell from how I'm doing now, uh, it shouldn't be hard. <laughs> uh, oh, this is an interesting one. Sorry, I missed the arrow on that one. Oh, shoot, no. Um. <laughs> that was bad. 
That was bad. I just, I hit four off the top and it was like, nah, this is not going well. 205. <laughs> Two silver lobe medals. Okay. I don't think silver lobe medals give you anything except for give you like a, a value on the main screen. Okay. So let's go back. So as you can see, we've done everything. So I think we are strongest in identify where we got three golds and one silver. We do okay in memorize two golds, two silver. We're also very strong in analyze. We are weak in computing and we are okay in visualization. Um, some of the games I didn't quite understand how to play them. So that's my excuse there. Other games, I don't think I understood how to... Other games I didn't understand... Like, sorry, the other games, the touch controls would have been a much better option, of course, uh, over the um, uh, over the, the controller controls. So, all right, we're going to head back. And what are our options now? A ghost clash. So we can play against somebody else. Or what's this? Hmm, I wonder what this button does. Try to earn more gold medals in every practice activity if you might be worth your while. Okay, so we got to earn more golds. Okay, um... Ghost Clash. Is this online stuff? Welcome to Ghost Clash, Adam. What are ghosts, you ask? Uh, well, a ghost is created when a student does an activity in a practice or a test, and that student actions are recorded exactly as they happened. And you see, since a ghost is a recording, you can't battle someone's ghost even if you aren't playing... You can, Oh, you can battle someone's ghost even if you aren't playing at the same time. Now then, go ahead and select an opponent to battle. Oh, okay, so you can do a friend's ghost, so one of your friends, a family's ghost, which is local play, or you can search for a ghost. That's interesting. I'm going to go back. Because one of the things I forgot is that we can now do tests. Um, so let's hop into the tests and see what all that, see what that's all about. Let's measure your big brain brawn having by having you complete activities in five categories: identify, memorize, analyze, compute, and visualize. Let's start the test. Five gold per test with bonus coins. Compute. Oh shoot! I didn't know which two add up to the numbers above. Uh, okay. I remember this one. I wasn't very good at it. Oh, no, that's not going to be right. Oh, you can uncheck. That's good to know. Uh, three and one. Uh, two and two. Um, five and one. Uh, uh, three and three. Uh, three and two. <laughs> Sometimes it takes me too long. This is seven. Uh, so that is six and one. Uh, that is uh, 2, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So we're going to go here and here. Okay? That's uh, 2, 4, 6, 8. Uh, so 5 and 3. Uh, that's 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. So we're going to go with uh, 9 and 1, obviously. That's 2, 4, 6, 8, 9. Um, I don't want to make a mistake, right? So uh, 5, no. Um, okay. See, the thing is, if you make a mistake, uh, you lose points. All right, so compute. Oh, we're doing analyze now. Analyze the cubes. Okay, I'm, I was decent at the cube game. So let's give this a go. How many cubes are there? Uh, three. Uh, four. Uh, five. Um, five. Uh, two, four, six. Okay, that's four, six, seven. Got them all the way over here. Uh, three, six, nine, eleven. Uh, two, four, seven, ten, twelve, fifteen, seventeen, nineteen, twenty. Okay. Uh, four, seven, ten, thirteen, sixteen. Uh, oh, uh, three, six, ten, fourteen, eighteen, twenty. Uh, two, four, six, eight. 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22. Uh, oh, geez, this is a difficult one. Uh, 4, 7, 11. Uh, no, I'm off. <laughs> 11, 16, yeah, I think that was uh, 18. Okay. Next is memorize. Uh, reverse memorize, reverse retention. Okay, let's give this a go. Reverse retention. You gotta do it backwards, remember. Me, do, uh, so that's do, me. Uh, four, two, so that's gonna be two, four. Uh, baby, horse, rooster, rooster, horse, baby. Okay, uh, hammer. There we go. Scissors, mallet, horn, horn, mallet, scissors. Baby. 
Oh, oh, jeez, oh, jeez, oh, jeez. Uh, uh, this, 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 this. <laughs> Me, fa, re, fa, la. No, I'm out. Uh, la, fa, re, fa, me? Oh my goodness! <laughs> horn, horn, violin, drums, horn. So, horn, drums, uh, violin, horn, horn. Horse, cow, pig, lion, rooster. Nah, I'm, I'm gonna try. That was a good score, though. I did really well on that one. Okay, on to the next part of the test. Visualize. Uh, oh, we're doing this one. I want a redemption on this. I want redemption. How does it look from the arrow? Straight on. Uh, obviously the green ball. Um, straight on. Uh, this one. Um, this one. Ooh, this is a hard one. This one. Oh, no. Okay. Uh, this one. Sideways. That way. Uh, this is straight on. Straight on. Um, left side. That one. This one. <laughs> that took a second. Oh, no, that was wrong. Oh, no, I got two wrong in a row. Oh, three wrong in a row! That hurt my score! Oh, no. Oh, no. Alright, identify. Oh, I like this one. Okay. Uh, okay. I don't know what some of these animals are supposed to be. I mean, like, I know that's a grasshopper. And I know that that's like a gorilla. That's a hippo. Cat. Or maybe dog. Um, I think the bee is the most one there. Uh, this will be the raccoon chipmunk. Not raccoon chipmunk. That's butterfly. Uh, that is the bee. Ooh. Uh, grasshopper. Nope. Hmm. This one's the grasshopper though. Oh, that's easy. Ladybug. What? Oh, no. Oh, I saw a lot of ants. I saw a lot of ants. Oh, jeez. Um, ladybug? Ladybug? All right. That wasn't the greatest of scores. I feel like I could have done better, but we'll take it. Well done. How was your first test? Your test results are reflected in your Big Brain Bronze score. The higher your score, the more impressive your performance. You may be interested to know, my Big Brain, brain Bronze score is around 3,300. An average person who hasn't spent time in practice will score around 1,500. Well, yes, I suppose I am pretty amazing then. <clears throat> Without further ado, let's take a look at the test results. Yes, let's do that. And my score is... Twenty-five nine five. I'll take that. Aha! This is a very good score indeed. Well, thank you for that. It's a very good score indeed. Um, now then, it's time to give you your brain grade. Okay, I want a brain grade. I this this is something I want. Um, yes, please give me that brain score. A plus plus. This is your brain's grade for the time being, but you're getting just getting started. Let's aim for even higher heights together. Now let's take a closer look at the test results. Look at that. So the computing is still a weak spot for me, right? And we knew that from the practice sessions, which was interesting. First things first, your best category was memorize. Have you considered memorizing all your friends' birthdays? You'd be quite popular. <laughs> Furthermore, there's more room for improvement in visualization. I recommend flexing and stretching there. Also, if you can answer a little faster, your big brain score should improve. Lastly, tell me, have you been collecting gold lobe medals in practice? I have no doubt you've, uh, you're have you capable of acquiring a nice collection of them. Well then, now that's time to announce your brain type, which is based on your big brain bronze score. This is your brain type at the moment. Memorize. Okay. <clears throat> I would not agree with that, but we got 10 points. 
So that means we're getting another item here. And we're gonna grab a, what was that? Eye patch? Oh, sci-fi glasses. Uh, no, we'll try that later. And then we're almost at 10 again. Awesome. Okay, so I'm gonna go back to practice. So we were weak in visualizing computing. Does that equate here? It kind of does. Although we were best in memorize, which is odd because we were best in identify prior to that. Um, obviously weak in computing, I can understand the weak in visualization. So that's interesting. So there's lots of room to practice. That seems to be the game. Uh, we'll have to figure out what this is, um, but that's gonna take a lot of time. We've unlocked 1.3% of the various things that you can get. Can we check my ranking? Um, so is this just among my friends? Oh, then you can check it in each one. So multiple people on the Switch, you can probably rank them ever all. So I should get my wife on this Switch. That would be really interesting. Okay, let's go back. So that seems to be it. Uh, we can do some online stuff. I'm not going to do that right now. I'm sure that's just like a test where you just compete in these various uh, different things. Um, so how many mini games are there total? Four per thing times five. So there's 20 different mini games you can do. I don't know how you feel about that, whether that's going to be worth it for you. Um, I could see this being really competitive in my house with my wife and kids. I think we're going to compete with this a lot, and I'm really looking forward to doing that with them. Before we go, guys, I want to say a quick thank you to our YouTube members, Talika Lynn, Olga Minen as gold members, Gladiator Carmelo, Bublio as silver members, and Gisela, Danny, Total Blank, Ian, Four Scars Gaming, Amy Grace, Jake, and Arena's Glory as bronze members. Of course, to our Patreon folks, Gladiator Carmelo, Andrew, or Gladiator and Carmelo's Platinum, Andrew's Gold, Alexis Holly, Kyrie as silver, and Ada, Amila, Bublio. Leo Marge Meenan and Homie Drew's Bronze. Guys, thank you so much for your monthly donations to the channel. It helps me buy games like this so I can quickly show them off to you and enjoy them with my family afterwards, as well as all the other opportunities that you guys give me. And, and I can't thank you guys enough. I had to buy a new capture card this week. You know that. So having some donation money set aside that I hadn't used for contests, I hadn't used for giveaways and contests, or I hadn't used for shipping... I was able to purchase that without even thinking twice about it, which is crazy because when I had to buy my new mic a couple months ago, that was a challenge, right? We're like, oh, how are we going to pay for the mic? And I was talking with my wife about it. And then Olga and Carmelo stepped up big time on that purchase. So thank you to them again. But this time it wasn't even a thought because I had some money put away thanks to your kind donation. So really, guys, the capture card is thanks to you and to everyone who watches. Please, uh, if you can't support um, monthly and, and the options are as low as $2.99 Canadian, $2.50 US on YouTube. If you can't do that, that's okay. I love that you watch, you share that you enter our contest, uh, chat with us on Discord, share the stuff on Reddit, guys. That would really help grow the channel, and we are growing. We are pushing towards 3,000 YouTube subscribers, and we're at 14 members. We had a goal for December to hit 15 uh, members. We didn't quite hit that. We're at 14, but we can get more members. If you want to become a member, you can hit that join button down below the video. It'll give you unique um, it will give you unique uh, emotes to use in the chat, only to you. A little badge that lets everybody know you're a member. You also get uh, access to a special discord channel which includes an ama with me so you can ask me literally anything you want and the other cool thing coming up in january is a slight boost to your contest entries it's not a lot so for people who aren't uh, members because maybe financially you cannot it's not a huge boost it's just a slight boost uh so someone who had for bronze if you had 100 entries in a contest you'd get 110 essentially is what you would get so it's not massive but a small little boost as a thank you for being a supporter and we have more stuff coming including merch and things like that the merch will be open to everybody if you want merch let me know tell me what you want to see maybe in the comments right now before the stream ends let me know if you want some merch let me know what kind of merch i should create should i create mugs should i create masks should i create stickers should i create shirts let me know if you'd be interested in that. It's a little bit of work to do it. I got to set up a storefront, get a graphics made and all that stuff. But if you would like to, I will do it for you. Okay, guys. Uh, last our shout out to Total Blank, who keeps our Discord channel going. A link down for Discord is in the description box if you want to click it. As well as to Matt C. Um, Matt C does all of our overlays for the stream. So the premiere logos, the live logos, the border that you'll see in live streams, not on a premiere video, but on a live stream, you'll see a border with the uh, members, subscribers, and donations, which is all very cool. He hooked up all the alerts. So if you guys donate during a stream, an alert pops up. He did all that. So a big, big thank you to Matt C for doing that for me. 
And finally, to my good friend Gladiator, who we are, uh, who I'm currently hosting a 25 days of giving contest with. You can find more details on Twitter, twittercom Raffle or twittercom Gladiator50 and the letter N. Until next time, everyone. Thanks for watching, and I hope we'll chat again real soon. Good night. <laughs>